Fiona Wozni, your Managing Director of World Resorts of Distinction, and that's a powerful name, isn't it? World Resorts of Distinction. But I know you've got quite a portfolio of properties in the South of the city. Sure. Why don't you tell me which properties yeah. you've got and a little yeah. bit about them? Um, well, the company World Resorts of Distinction, the name came from the need to be able to group a, a, um, a selection of hotels that are similar um, but different. Uh, they're all independently owned, the properties that we work with, and they're located in uh, Fiji, yeah. Samoa, and the Cook Islands. Okay. Uh, yeah, and so we're very fortunate. We get to work with the owners of the resorts, yeah. and each of the resorts is very unique and boutique in its own way. Um, the common factor is quality. Quality and size. Yeah. And I think it's ex the experience rather, and the quality is always measured in different ways, yeah. but I think the experience is the most important thing of anybody's um, holiday. And What do you mean by experience in terms of world resorts? Um, well, I think, you know, it's not just you know, a beautiful bed or, you know, a um, uh, um, air conditioning or anything like that. It's more about what's outside the room. I mean, while the comfort in the room is very important, I think it's the outside. It's the the elements, it's the people, it's the, um, you know, the staff, um, and it's, it's just all the, the varying experiences that you get. So it's not, yeah, it's about the, it's more than just the hotel. But of course, I mean, we work with some beautiful properties. In Fiji, we get, we work with uh, Tokariki Island Resort in the Mamanuthas, yeah. Uh, Tundrai Island Resort in the Mamanuthas. Uh, we work with Gamea uh, Resort and Spa, which is up in the beautiful northern part of uh, Fiji, off um, an island called Taviuni. Uh, we work with Tombarua, which is a little gem of a property off Suva. It's only got five little rooms around this tiny little island. Um, and uh, we work for Sonasali Island Resort, which is a, a, a bit of a larger property, but great for... Well, yeah, absolutely. I mean, it's an island, but really very close to the mainland. And then in the Cook Islands, we work with uh, Murray Beach Club Hotel, um, which is just a fabulous property. Um, little Polynesian, which is, you know, just as sweet as can be. Um, Rumours, luxury spa. Oh, nice. And yeah, it's a stunning property um, with seven beautiful villas. Um, and over on Ashitaki, we work with Ashitaki Escape. Again, absolutely stunning villas, all with their own private pools. And we also work for, um, in the Cook Islands, we work with the newest cultural centre called Tavaranui. So the Cook Islands are relatively unknown in Australia, but very well known in New Zealand. I know, it's funny, isn't yeah. it? Uh, you know, it's such an amazing destination, and um, I, I, we are seeing some growth, so, I mean, Australia is definitely a growth market yes. for the Cook Islands, and, um, you know, it's such a magic place, and it's somewhere that I think that everybody needs to put on their uh, to-do list, because if you haven't tried it, uh, it really does offer amazing experiences. But I mustn't forget, I also work for a beautiful property in Samoa called Sinalay Reef Resort and Spa. Is that fairly new to your portfolio? No, no, we've been working with Sinalay for probably about 12 years yep. now, mm -hmm. and um, it's been an absolute pleasure, because, you know, the property is such... I mean, it's one of those places when you arrive through uh, the entrance of the resort, you actually, you can feel yourself calm down. It really is an amazing place. They really have the whole aura of the property is fantastic. Now, just in terms of what you do for these properties, it's quite yeah. interesting, because as an organisation, you've got all these amazing properties. It's hard to imagine a nicer portfolio of properties. Yeah, I mean, we're very fortunate. You could have lots of city hotels and hotels in Yeah, absolutely. Parts, but you don't have those. No. You've got character, experiential, intimate, privately owned, all the things that people are looking for. But what do you do for them in the marketplace? So, uh, we have offices in Australia, New Zealand, and in um, the USA. And uh, we work with um, the partners that actually sell the properties to the consumer, uh, the consumers in those markets. But we also help position the properties um, through the various different um, distribution channels. And we also uh, work with their so on their social media platforms. Um, and we develop their rate strategies. I mean, we do a lot. We're a very um, cross-market. Um, we do sort of like the global connection, aren't you? Well, so for some of these smaller properties who you know, are busy running their businesses, you're providing the link to the world and how they sell themselves. Yeah, and, and what you find with smaller properties um, is they don't have the budget to have a full sales and marketing team based at the resort, and so we're actually an extension of their team. So when I'm, I'm out working uh, for a particular property, I'm working solely for that property and I, as their sales and marketing person. So um, we like to get really intimately involved in the, uh, the entire business of the property. Um, so we work with the owners, which is a really, um, I, I feel very fortunate that I get to work 
work with people at, the, at that level. Because they're passionate about the property in their business, because it's their dream. Their yeah, they're fabulous they're hoteliers, yeah. they're fabulous hoteliers, but you know, my speciality is sales and marketing and so, you know, we, we're able to work very closely and, and work well together. So how long has World Resorts of Distinction been in existence? 22 years young. It's amazing. I know, it? yeah, I know. Wow. Yeah, we've been very fortunate and, and you know, we've worked with a lot of our clients for a very long time. Um, we've been working with Tokariki for 16 years wow. now. So, yeah, um, we tend to become part of their team, part of their family yeah. and, um, you know, it's great. It's great. We get to know the staff well, we get to know the owners well and, yeah, it's, it's really, I feel very fortunate to be able to do what I do. Well, Fiona, thank you for your time today. Yeah, thank, uh, thank you. you explanation about what WRD does. If somebody wants to get information on World Resource of Distinction and look at some of these properties, is there a website they can go to? Yeah, absolutely. You can go to just www.wrd.com.au. Fiona Wosley, thank you for your time. Thanks very much.